What's going on YouTube? It's hey you us back here for a new video, a and quick review. Same at day. 12.49 a.m. We just got back from the Rihanna concert and I didn't want to lose the excitement of telling exactly how I felt about the concert. Right now I just want you to notice her excitement and then notice my excitement. Okay, keep on going. Okay, so we went to the concert. I tried to go in open-minded, even though I did sneak on YouTube a couple of times and check out some of the concert, which I already was just like, Ugh, but I wanted to have a Rihanna experience. I've never been to a Rihanna concert. Okay, so we got there, and it was ASAP Rocky. He actually did good. You know, I don't know a lot of um, ASAP Rocky songs. I had meant to go on YouTube and listen to some before we actually did the concert, but I didn't. I didn't know a lot of them, but he did really good. Like, he's really talented. And you can yes, tell he, he really loves what he, he does. does. How did you feel about A.S.? A.S.A.P. Rocky. I don't know why I want to call him A.S.A.P. Rocky. I liked it. I really liked him. I really wish I would have knew more of his songs so I could have been like, hey, with everybody else. But when my song came on at the end, I love bad bitches. That's my problem. Went off for you, ASAP Rocky. I'm going to buy a couple of songs that I heard today. I really did enjoy your performance. Thank you. Okay, so Rihanna comes on. Drum roll. Okay, so Rihanna, I was really, really excited to see Rihanna because I know most of Rihanna's songs. I knew all of them that she actually sung. And she did a lot of songs. Like, she did a lot of her hit things. The only thing that was missing was Skim for me. I really wish she would have did Skim, but... Anyway, it was good. My problem was sometimes it got like a little dry. Like I'm used to like, you know, concerts to keep going, keep going, keep going. Like she was late. She didn't get on stage until after 10 o'clock, which is crazy to me because other concerts I've been to is almost over at 10 o'clock. And um, she she did do a big apology to Baltimore. I mm -hmm. really felt like she sincerely was sorry. And, you know, I really do. I really did appreciate that because I really felt some type of way about Rihanna canceling. Like, I really at first didn't even think she was sick. But whatever. I, you know, whatever. So, um, Rihanna is actually a good concert. I feel like Rihanna needs to be a little more upbeat. And Rihanna isn't the best singer live and i've said this before i mean it's no surprise i'm not here to bash brianna all i'm giving is my remo my review so rihanna navy please don't kill me but yeah she's really not that good of a singer but she definitely does you know try her best to pop lock that's all people want to do is see her pop lock and drop it shake it she did that twerk it twapped it i feel like she pointed at me but whatever so now, how you feel about it? um it was a fun time um, I'm glad I got to go and I'm glad I got to experience. It's probably something I will never pay for to go see again. And that is no shade. I do not want the Rihanna Navy to come and bash me. If you do, that's fine. I don't care. But, um, yeah, like it was nice. My favorite part was, um, I went and looked it up so I could say the right thing. Rockstar. I love Rockstar. I love What Now. I really think that was my favorite part of the show. Um, I love that she was so apologetic and it seemed sincere. Like, you know, sometimes they come on there and they be like, sorry, yeah. but we about to turn up. Like, she kept on saying it. She kept on saying how sorry she was and I really, really appreciate that. You know, she said she appreciated that we came. Um, I can say, like, um, during the show, like, I was pumped up because I know every Rihanna song. I have every Rihanna album on my iTunes, not on my phone. But, like, so I know Rihanna's song, so that wasn't the problem. It was just that, like, she wasn't grabbing my attention. Like, some of it really got boring, and then her dance moves were, like, repetitive. It was the same little side wine. I mean, you did it. That's what your fans like, so... Go ahead, but I'm just used to something different. I can say that she could have got rid of every single one of those background dances. It was just just, she could have just did it herself. Like they really, they almost annoyed me. But um, yeah, it was it was fun. It was nice. Um, I want to say this one last thing though, and I know the last thing I'm gonna say, y'all are gonna be very upset, and that is fine too. But this is our show, and I feel like I can speak my mind. Speak it. Okay. I feel like you, you, the Rihanna Navy, deserves better. I feel like y'all go so hard for her. 
y'all, you know, cuss out anybody and somebody got to say something, you fat, y'all be like, you fat, bitch, blah, blah, blah. Like, y'all really go in when somebody say something about Rihanna. And I'm really not talking about Rihanna. I'm, like, I'm talking about you guys. Like, you guys go so hard. You guys love her so much. And it just seems like she's giving you guys a mediocre show. This is what I would like for you to do. Every Rihanna person that has went to this Rihanna show and y'all loved it, know her, and she slayed. That's fine if that's what y'all think she did. I would like for y'all to go buy a ticket to go see Beyonce's show. Y'all can get, uh, um, what is it called? A cheap ticket. Get Find a $50 one. Like, just go and experience that. And I feel like then you... Then you don't know what, like, a real, real performance is. Like, I just feel like what she gave y'all was mediocre and she could have done better. Because y'all was like, y'all wait. First of all, for the Baltimore show, I don't know about anybody else if they watch this in other states. We had to wait a whole month because she canceled it because her laryngitis. Okay, whatever. Okay, we waited a whole month. Then when we get there, ASAP Rocky comes on. He performs for a whole 45 minutes. Oh, oh, okay. Then... And I mean, you know, I'm not even going to say nothing because he had fans that came in, so... He had a lot of big exactly. fans. So, you know, he did his 45 minutes. Bam! Then we waiting for Rihanna. We waited for Rihanna We for waited like... for Rihanna for a long time. This show was supposed to start at 7.30. ASAP Rocky did not come out at 7.30. He was a DJ person there. Once ASAP Rocky did come out, he performed until about 8.45, 9 o'clock. And then I really, really think Rihanna did not come on the stage till almost 10. If I'm not mistaken. It was like, after 10. I, I'm just saying, like, we waited so long. Like, some of the stuff I just wish you really would have just gave it to us. Like, I really, I feel like I like Rockstar so much because she was, like, rolling on the ground. And she was really doing it. And I wish you, Singing I just wish upside you, down. Yes, like, I really wish you just would have did that the whole show. Like, I really wish you would have gave your, your all. And if that is your all, I'm sorry for, you know, saying it wasn't. But it just didn't seem like it. Like, I just know, Rihanna, you can do so much better. And I know Renee, yo, or what's they call? Navy, Navy. Rihanna Navy. I know y'all want so much more. Like, I know y'all want more. Let I'm me... just upset that you guys stand for a mediocre artist. You, you want a bit much now. Okay, sorry. So, I will say this. In the but I love her. In the and I went. And I was there. In the beginning of the show, I really was convinced that Rihanna was on drugs. Like, I really had, like... I thought she popped a molly. I really had flashes of, like, Whitney Houston in my head. What? You see all these bikers? Yeah. That's not weird? I guess. Okay. I really had flashes of Whitney Houston in my head. Like, I thought it was about to be... I don't know if y'all have ever seen Why Do Fools Fall In Love? When he had, like, took too many drugs and was about to pass out on the stage. He started nodding off and shit. It's another movie, too, where somebody get, like, drunk or high and come on stage. And, like, I already knew she was going to smoke weed. But, y'all, I really felt like she was on that white girl tonight. Like, yeah, she I was thought she slipped the line. Swaying. Like, she was just like, I see Like, numb, numb had really I, become live numb. a real thing for her. I really felt like she was numb. Doing, I'm going to go on YouTube tomorrow and look it up to see if that's what she do for each performance. Because if she do, Tiffany was she scared. is a hell of an actor, actress. Did that serious. Like, I thought she was about to pass out. I'm going to... Like, really, like, had me scared for a second. But overall, I had fun. I'm very out of happy. Three, out of five stars, I will give it a three. I'm very happy that I got the experience. Thank um you. I probably won't go to another Rihanna concert. And that's no shade. I just feel like I needed to go to one. But I can watch it on TV. Like, as far as I'm concerned. I can watch it on YouTube. Like... Yeah, like, I probably won't go to another one. Like, she would... In order for me to go to another Rihanna concert, she would have to put out a hot-ass CD. Like, one that I just could not miss. Better than Lao. Yeah. So, we have a... Oh, um, no, oh, sorry. I don't mean... To, I didn't mean to cut you off. But before you cut her off... I did miss one song. Re, why didn't you do Get It Over With? That is my favorite song. She did put song. the beat on. That wasn't enough for me. Um, That's my favorite song on the album. But I did. Me. Oh yeah, I did. So I already said that I did want to do skin, but but you did an awesome job on stay, and you I did an awesome stay. job on diamonds. Diamonds stay. 
like I said, Rockstar 101. What now, girl? Good luck. You killed it. That's you when you killed brought the fire it. out, girl. And can I, I tell you, I wish you would have saw Tanea. Because I had almost went into the Navy. I am so sorry for the girl who was sitting next to me. Or whoever was sitting with my hand. Because her hair was going like this. I was just... They was prepared, honey. I was there. So, so yeah. but... Like, I will say this, though. She is beautiful. She's gorgeous. Rihanna is so gorgeous. Like, her face is... Her eyes, like she's just she's beautiful. She's gorgeous from head to toe. She like is her beautiful. skin is beautiful. The color is beautiful. It's just like clear. Her lips, her nose, everything. Like she's gorgeous. Like I'm giving my review right now, but literally, I stood up and danced every song and I, sung I, every song. I stood up the whole time because I just didn't want to keep on getting up and getting down. But I, it was nice. Like I mean, it was fun. It was something I'm glad yeah. I got to do. I'm really, I'm really happy I had fun, and I'm happy for. All of the people that follow me on Instagram and on Twitter, um, who I also saw with there, I saw a lot of other people who were doing, you know, a couple shout outs. Shira, the girl Ashley, Ashley Muddy, my sister Mimi. Yeah, shout out to Mimi. She was there. Tori Crystal. Tori Crystal. Like, it was a lot of people in the building. Like, Baltimore definitely showed their love. So, I'm just excited about the rest of the concerts I have lined up for the rest of the year. Next I know up I told is. I is to hurry the hell Beyonce. up. On her picture. Yeah, she did take a long time. I told her to hurry her fucking ass up. I said, we already waited a month. Hurry up. She apologized. She did a nice apology. She did a nice apology. But All I right, like guys. Friends, so I can talk to her like that. So we about to wrap this up. Hit the bed. You know, we should have been know. back like an hour ago, but re held it's this up. It's one in the morning. Thank yeah. God I don't got open. But shout out to Rhea. I'm really happy I went. Yeah. I see you, boy. No, no, no.